Good evening, everybody. Semi Thunder here with a, another video of card findings. Some more mail that I received. Um, and also uh, card shop pickups. I um, almost didn't want to make this video today because of a mishap with um, a card that I purchased on eBay. Actually, not a purchase, but more of a bidding that I, I, I won an auction for a 1969 Nolan Ryan Tops card. And so it was mailed, um, required a signature, and so lo and behold, I find that the status of the tracking shows that it was delivered and left with an individual, but as soon as I got home, there was no sign of it anywhere. And left me with very little to move on with because uh, by the time I got home, the post office was closed and there was no way to get someone on the line. So I'm just at a point right now where I'm just kind of waiting and hoping. So uh, maybe it was foolish, I don't know. But I guess we'll wait and see. On the more positive side, I went to um, the Stormville Flea Market in upstate New York, in Stormville, New York, and I was able to find quite a bit of some fun things. Um, there's this box here, which is, uh, bought this, uh, you'll see it, a 1986 Topps baseball set for $10. Um, I, I purchased one of these before, I got one of these for free. Um, but I found this, uh, the, the, the free one that I received didn't have um, a lot of the, uh, the signature base cards that are, that are key for this set. So I bought this one for $5. It didn't have the Shaq or anything, but it did have the Michael Jordan base card. So I thought that was a good, good buy. I went to another vendor and I purchased these three boxes, one from uh, KB Toys. Looks like this was, this was Tops that was made, set in 1987. And I'll open these up. This one, another KB Toys, this one was for 1986. And then uh, a company I'm not, <laughs> Woolworth, I think they're, they're no longer um, open. They're, I don't know if they still have any stores, but um, as a kid I remember them. And this one, uh, I don't, can't see what year it is, but we'll open this up and we'll take a look at them. Um, also bought a couple packs we can open up tonight. I bought this Topps pack, uh, 1989. Maybe we'll get some nice cards in there. Uh, I bought these NBA Hoops cards. I was debating on opening them, but I figured why not? I mean, I actually have a lot of these sets already. Um, the 1991 Fleer, I think I'm getting from uh, from the past is alive, if I remember the year was right. It might be 1990 that I received. The, I think these are the 91 and 92 Series 1, and then this one, NBA Hoops. Um, Oh no, that's right. I'm getting the NBA hoops cards from him, but I, I have the, I have a lot of these cards already, so I'm not too, you know. I, I've had people tell me I shouldn't open these, but I figured I'd have some fun, open them up. Lastly, um, this is a combination of card shows, uh, not card show, card shop stuff, as well as some, uh, some mail for my 1969 set that I'm just adding, and then also I finally got the last card from my 1965 set, so I'm thinking that tomorrow. I will uh, do a video showcasing the entire 65 set as it is finally complete. Um, and then also I got these kind of cool little ice cream hats for the ba different baseball teams. Um, collecting these as well. I got them for free. The guy was just selling them for a quarter. I didn't have any change at the, at the flea market today. And he just gave them to me. Very nice guy. So, why don't we start with the Woolworth box. We'll save the packs for the end as that's always the, you know, love the uh, air of mystery. So I'm gonna start with these. I'm gonna open them up and see what condition they're in. I didn't really look at them. The guy selling them, you know, seemed really cool. Just, I was having fun um, just selling his cards, selling his collection. And, um, didn't, you know, he was not so much concerned about pricing. I got, um, oh wait, you know what? I'm sorry, I totally botched something. I have more cards. Yes, sorry about that. I have more cards here. These, I'll show these in a minute. Uh, and I think, yes, there's some more here. I'll get around to all this stuff. Sorry about that. So, getting back to the Woolworth box. Um, 
I don't exactly know what the price was. He gave me those three boxes plus a couple baseball cards for like uh, for seven bo for um, I think it was for five bucks. Yeah, we'll go through these. We got Gary Carter. <laughs> there we go. Gary Carter, Rick Honeycutt, Kirk Gibson, John Franco, Jose Canseco, Gene Nelson. Look at that. Man. Look at that mullet, man. That is that is crazy, crazy mullet. Mark McGuire. Oral Hershiser, Wade Boggs, Walt Weiss, remember him, he was the, uh, I think he played for the Braves and then uh, later on became the manager of the Rockies at one point, uh, Frank Viola, another Kirk Gibson, Jay Howell, Andre Dawson, the Hawk, Chris Sabo, Dennis Eckersley, Greg Jeffries, Mike Marshall, Tim, Tom Browning, another Canseco, Pat Tabler, Oral Hershiser, Randy Johnson, that's a pretty cool card. Mike Davis, George Bell, Mackey, or Mickey Hatcher, Jeff Reardon, Kevin McReynolds, Doug Jones, Tim Belcher, Tim Belcher, Hershiser, another Hershiser. So, all right. Not bad for to start that off. Kind of, I think my favorite card out of that was definitely the Randy Johnson. That was pretty cool. You don't really see a lot of cards. Um, I mean, there are there are cards of him with him on the Expos, but you know everybody remembers him for being on the, uh, the Mariners when he started his career. Let's put the box down. We'll open up the KB Toys one. This is from uh, Super Glossy Set, number 1986. Let's see who we let's see who's in this one. I recently picked up the, um, what's it called, the uh, the Kirby Pocket one, so I wonder if it's in here. We got started off with Tony Gwynn, Ernie Riles, Daryl Strawberry, it's a great shot of him, Vince Coleman, Tony Fernandez, Ron Darling, Tom Bernanski, Jim Presley, Donnie Baseball, Don Mattingly, Andy Van Slyke, Brian Fisher, Kirby Puckett, this might be the one that I have. Yeah, this is the one that I have, I think. Doc Gooden, Oda B. McDowell, Juan Samuel, Julio Franco, Roger McDowell, Frank Viola, Rick Aguilera, Mark Salas, Brett Saberhagen, Tom Browning, Sean Dunstan, Alvin Davis, Jeff Stone, Pendleton, I'm just going to go through the rest. Ozzy Guillen. Cool. Cool little packs. Might look at um, selling these soon. I have a tag sale I'm going to be working on in a few weeks with uh, family, so I might include these guys in that tag sale. We got this last one here. We'll take a look inside and see, what, see what's inside. I have a checklist on the back, but I, didn't, I, didn't, I don't want to be surprised at it, so I'm going to just kind of surprise myself with these cards. Got Mike Scott, Dave Parker, Sandberg, Valenzuela, got Boggs, Winfield, Carter, got Henderson, Eddie Murray, Dale Murphy, Coleman, George Brett, Kirby Puckett, another, another strawberry. It looks like they use the same picture. Gwyn, man, is that, is that really Tony Gwynn? I mean, my God, he's, he's really skinny in that photo, or muscular. Schmidt, Canseco, Clemens, that's a cool shot. Doc Gooden, Carter, Donnie Baseball, Tim Raines, Harold Baines, Guerrero, Jack Morris, and Hernandez. Cool. So, yeah, the next, uh, what else? so the same vendor also had just a box of cards that were charging, I was asking like 25 cents and um, said if, you know, if, uh, if you pick out 25 cards, you'll get them for five bucks. So I took them up on that and I found 25 cards I wanted. Um, these are the ones that I picked up in the box. I got a Ricky Henderson 81 Donruss. I thought that I got a Ken Griffey Jr. the Gold Cup, the Rookie Cup. This is, a, I think it was 73, Mickey Lalich. Got a Donruss 81, Steve Carlton. 
Reg Quaker Chewy Granola Bars, Reggie Jackson, George Brett, Hernandez, uh, 81 Carew, 86 Puckett, another Ken Griffey Jr. Gold Cup, 81 Palmer, 81 Carter, 81 Winfield, this is an 82 or 83, uh, 82 Tim Raines. This is kind of cool. This is like a CC Sabathia Barry Zito Prospects card. 87 Gwynn. 82 Sargil. Got a Fleer 90 Ken Griffey Jr. Eddie Murray. Got Boggs, I believe, 86. Carlton. Eddie Murray. A third gold cup. Got a, uh, what does it say, 79 Ozzie Smith. Got a Nolan Ryan, Steve Carlton, Tom Seaver, Fleer, Ricky Henderson, and finally the 86 Roger Clemens. Got these all for five bucks. I think I did pretty well there. And same vendor. Um, actually, let's see if we separate the ones that. So the, ven the vendor, I got this Dennis Eckersley. Oh, dropped it. Um, so I got this Dennis Eckersley. Uh, I think this is his second year or third year. It's a 77. Got it for, uh, I think I got it for two or like either a dollar or two bucks. Um, pretty good shape. I mean, there's some, you know, rough, there's some corners, sort of some soft corners, but car looks to be in pretty decent shape. Also, I'm a big Jacob DeGrom fan. I, the fan, I got this um, Bowman DeGrom. I think this is from last year. Or is this, uh, maybe is this, yeah, or this year. So, that was a cool card. Yeah, I gave it to me. I asked, you know, he didn't <laughs> budget price, obviously, so I got it for two bucks. Um, from a different vendor of the, at the Stormville uh, flea market, I also picked up this Raleigh Fingers for a buck and this Patrick Ewing for three dollars. Um, again, I got this uh, 9293 with uh, Michael Jordan and the base cards in there. I'm going to take it out and put it in a sleeve and top loader later. It's incomplete. Got it for five bucks. But let's move on to some of the some of the mail and the card shop purchases. So we'll do the card shop first. So I've been wanting this card for a while. Um, the center is not great, but the condition, the corners are sharp. As you can see, everything looks pretty good. Now he, uh, the, the, the value he had this out was 90. Um, I've purchased from this guy a lot, Village Baseball Cards up in Carmel, New York. I highly recommend going there. Um, I feel bad because I can't remember if his name was Mike or Dave, but I think it's Mike. And super nice guy. I think, you know, I, since I've purchased from him a lot, he I think he gave me a nice deal because of it. Um, I got this for 60 bucks. Um, so when he told me of that value, I said, that, to me it was a no brainer. His uh, all-star rookie card. I think um, a lot of people value this kind of in the, as his rookie in his own way. Um, so I thought it was an awesome, you know, Tom Seaver 68. I uh, found this to add to my 69 collection, the Pete Rose. Um, he had this uh, for half off, so I got this for 10 bucks. The Bobby Mercer, I thought this was this card was super sharp, so I got this for five. And um, this this Tom Seaver 76, I got this for five bucks. He was charging 50% on a certain case, so I bought this as well. So these four all together got this for, for 80 bucks. Nice to add in my collection. Um, I, got the C, I got the same Seaver card at Stormville, and I got the, um, the guy who was running that booth gave this to me for each. So, um, you know, I'll have to... Maybe see what I'm going to do with one of the Seavers. Maybe I'll, um, I'll sell it, or if anybody's interested, we can talk. So, moving on to the mail. Some of the items I got in, I got from the mail on a Facebook group. Um, all, 69, all 69 cards added to the collection. These cards are super sharp. Um, really good condition overall. Start with Woody Fryman. Got Jim Hannon. Got Jim Brewer. Manny Moda, Davenport, Coleman, Dave Ricketts, Ed Charles, Johnny Briggs, that's one stack. Most of these are commons. I think there's um, there's a Greg Nettles rookie card in here. Tony Taylor. 
Uh, here's the Larry Sherry. I forgot this was included in that. Um, he, had the, he had the Larry Sherry 65. This is like the last card that I needed. So put this over here. Ed Cranepool. Got the Don Drysdale. Has a little bit of condition issue in the corner, but you know, I think it's a pretty good card. Tony uh, Conagliaro. Uh, Rusty Staub. Richie Allen. Got Pat Dobson. Mike Tekic. Here's the Greg Nettles rookie card. Pretty cool. A um, little bit of condition issues on this corner, but um, good card overall. Bob Pretty, Harrelson, and uh, Keeley. Got uh, Buddy Bradford, Vic De uh, De Villa, De Villio, and uh, Fred Gladding. So. Uh, not a bad mail-in for that. Um, I got it from a, uh, a guy who was looking to get rid of Commons and offered the Drysdale as well. So, and the Greg Nell's rookie. So I thought that was pretty cool. Um, so why don't we go ahead? We'll open up these packs. You know, hopefully uh, get some good stuff in here. We'll see what we can find. So let's see. I'm gonna I'll start with the baseball pack. So let's start with here. We'll start with the tops. See the gum stains pretty bad on here. There's the gum. So we're starting off with uh, Jeff Kunkel, Craig McMurdy, got Gene Larkin, Tom Treblehorn, uh, Scott Garrels, Mark Davis, Mike Smithson, Company Store. Got a Galarraga All-Star card. Ty Griffin, number one draft pick. Pat Sheridan. Gino Petrali. It's pretty cool. Steve Avery, first, in, that's his rookie card. And, and a Jim Abbott. Pretty damn cool to get these two together. Got Manny Trillo and Tim Cruz. But hey, you know, Steve Avery and for a buck. I got this pack for a buck. Not bad. So I'll put these off to the side, you know. I should eat this gum. Pretty damn stiff for 1989 gum. Cool. Open up the NBA. Let's see. Um, I'm gonna leave the. Which one should I open up first? I'm gonna put this. I'm gonna put this last. This second. So we'll open up this NBA hoops car app pack first. Let's see who we get. So we're starting off with uh, Kevin Willis, got Kevin Gamble, got Rex Chapman, looking for the Jordan, BJ Armstrong, Darnell Valentine, got James Edwards, Charles Jones, Herb Williams, Michael Adams, Sarunas, Marshy Lonis. Who we got here? Oh, very cool. David Robinson celebration from graduation. Never seen this card before. Leave Huck all out. Interesting. It's like a it's like a little promotional item. Hundred years of hoops. Got Tom Chambers. Larry but young Larry Brown. And you got the Los Angeles Lakers. Pretty cool. Right, there's no serious standouts of that, but that's all right. Let's open up the Fleer 91. Again, we'll hope for the Jordan. Maybe a bird or a magic. Starting off with uh, Kevin Lowry. Cotton Fitzsimmons. Oh, very cool. You got the Jordan, the Jordan base card. That is sweet. I picked the right pack today. I'm gonna put this off to the side. Nice and a nice fresh pack. Fresh Jordan. An awesome right back to back. Got Patrick Ewing. Put that off to the side. Got Jimmy Rogers. Got Bill Fitch. Blair Rasmussen. Got Grant Long. Got Lenny Wilkins. 
Mike Dunleavy. Another Sarunas. Ron Anderson. You got Akeem Olajuwon and Chuck Daly. Very cool. I should, maybe I shouldn't have opened up, opened up that pack. That's all right, though. And lastly, let's get the NBA hoops in on the action here. Let's find another Jordan. Maybe find the all-star card or find his base card in here. I'm going to start it off with Moses Malone. That's a pretty cool, nice start. Got John Shasky. Johnny Dawkins. Dennis Hobson. Bernie Bickerstaff. Got Dwayne Washington. Got old Kurt Rambis with the uh, special sports glasses. Got a Charles Oakley. Got a Dominique Wilkins All-Star card. Got a Jeff Lamp. Walter Berry. Got a Harvey Grant. Charles Barkley All-Star card. Mike Iavaroni. Dale Ellis. But you know what, hey man, we went one for three on those on those basketball cards and picked up that Jordan. I think that's pretty sweet, all, all things considered. And you got the Steve Avery and the Jim Abbott. Not bad. So, um, yeah, we're, you know what, that makes that wraps up for today. I will uh, definitely make another video, probably tomorrow, um, do one on the 65 set because I finally completed it uh, after f over four months of working on it. And hopefully, you know, I'll get that other card in the mail. I mean, uh, the Nolan Ryan, hopefully that comes in the mail tomorrow, maybe. I mean, I know they do, they do extra delivery, so... You know, we'll see what happens. And, uh, yeah, I want to thank you guys for checking it out tonight. Um, hopefully I'll have found some cool stuff this weekend as well. Look forward to seeing y'all's videos, and um, have a good night, everybody.